Hi, this is Jennifer from Tarl Speech with your pronunciation question. Today's question is how do I pronounce the word recognize and how do I add the suffixes ed, ing, and tion. Let's go ahead and take a look at my little um, chart that I made for you here. Right here, you're gonna see numbers which I typically don't have um, on my directions and the words. But the reason I have them here is because that is going to tell you how many syllables we have in each word. So let's start with the root word recognize. Three beats, three syllables. Recognize. Now the key here is that we are going to stress syllable one. So even though that is a short vowel in that syllable, we're going to hold that vowel a little tiny bit longer. We're gonna make that um, syllable a little bit higher in pitch, and we're also going to make that syllable a little bit louder. So recognize, recognize, recognize. Now, when we add the ed to this word, if you're interested in this rule, I actually have a class on how to pronounce ed endings. Um, so you can check that out if you have uh, more questions. But here, because the word ends in a Z sound, which is voiced, we're going to end that um, word when we add the ED with a D sound because the D is also voiced. This is not going to add another syllable. We're just going to add that extra sound on to the end of the word. So again, we're going to stress syllable one, and then we're going to make sure that we just add that D sound to the end of the word. So rec recognized, recognized, recognized. Now, for recognizing, what happens here is when you add that ing, it actually is another beat in the word. So let's listen to that, recognizing. So you have four beats there. Again, syllable number one is stressed, rec, recognizing, recognizing, recognizing. So let's listen to all those words again. Recognize, recognized, recognizing. Now you will hear slight differences with the syllables um, and the lengths of the vowels in each of those syllables because if you've watched my classes on word stress, you know that as words get longer and have more syllables, we have to shorten some of the vowels even though it's exactly the same vowel because we only have a certain amount of time to say that word. So let's listen to those three words again. Recognize, recognized, recognizing. Lastly, we have the word recognition. This word really throws people off because we shift the syllable stress to the syllable before the shun. So I have a class on this concept as well if you wanna take a look at that. So. This word is going to have four beats, four syllables, but we're going to shift the word stress from the rec to the n. That's why I have it underlined and in capital letters. So let's take a look at the syllables. Rec, ug, n, shun. Recognition. 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 I'm going to say all the words in order now. Recognize. Recognized recognizing, recognition. So give it a try. I know people are going to notice the difference if you found this helpful. We always appreciate a like and a share and a subscription if you haven't already subscribed. And uh, if you have any questions, please leave them in the comments section below. And for our products and classes, you can find those at tarlspeech.com. Thank you so much and I'll see you again soon.